Right, so we're going to do a quick video on how does the shower work and what's inside of it. <coughs> so basically, water. This is your inlet. Water inlet. I was leaking at you. Cold water to that. And when you turn it on, the marker switch switches on the solenoid, which lets water into the flow control valve, and also operates the micro switches. Once the micro switches operate, that operate that turns on the heating elements. And then you can set either one element or two elements. Two elements on it. So high is two elements. And economy is only one element. And then you control the flow by turning this valve up and down that controls the flow of water through the heat, heat heater can or heat exchanger. So the slower the water goes, the more time it's in with the heating element, the hotter it gets. <coughs> That's it basically, so water comes in, goes into your tank, flows around it, comes out through here. You've got a thermal cutout, so you've got a solenoid, flow valve, your marker switches, your on off switch, your wiring, your incoming wiring, thermal cutter, heater exchanger, this is your outlet and that's your pressure relief valve there. So, pretty simple but brilliant machines. And that's it really. So you turn it on, solenoid comes on, lets water into the flow valve which controls the amount of water flowing through the heater. The pressure switch here turns the elements on. If you haven't got enough pressure, that will not operate and your switches and your elements will not turn on. And there's your heaters, heating elements at the top. We have to change the old lot if your elements go. And then you've got your outlet there. And that's it. So basically that's your flow control. Just connects onto your control the heat.